What's up guys? It's Sydney and Cameron. If you're new to my channel, this is my brother. Today we're going to be doing a very excited and requested video, which is our souvenir popcorn bucket slash sipper collection. If you're new to my channel, make sure to hit subscribe and comment down below with what your favorite item in this collection video was. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. All of my social media and my P.O. box is down below if you want to send me a note. And with that being said, let's just hop right into the Hop video. right into the popcorn bucket. First, we both have one of these popcorn buckets which were around during the 60th anniversary of Disneyland. This is a Disneyland balloon. It says 1955 to 2015. I use mine to store keychains. There's a little thing on the back that it opens like this, closes. It says Disneyland 60, 10 out of 10 quality popcorn bucket. I have this from our main girl, Ashley, what's up? Next up, I'm going to talk about this popcorn bucket, which is from Tokyo. If you watched our Tokyo vlogs, you'll have seen it in there. It just looks like Minnie Mouse. It opens like this. I have every intention to use it as a purse in the park someday. So, Mr. Curry popcorn has now entered the building. Next up from Tokyo, we have this amazing Stitch popcorn bucket. This is what he looks like. He has open mouth abilities. <laughs> and, he comes with, <laughs> and he comes with a lanyard. <laughs> and um, you actually get refills, discounted refills on your popcorn bucket in Tokyo, which we don't have in Disneyland. People so annoying. Sombrero Donald. He opens like this. He originally held flan, which my dad ate because I just I needed this and not the flan. And it's so cute. And it's from the Mexican restaurant in Disney Sea, and I love it. Okay, so I bought this because I have found a certain obsession with the aliens from Toy Story. Ooh, the claw. Ooh, the claw. And they're kind of coming back, so I have like a whole shelf worth of merch for him and Rex from the movie The Green Dinosaur. And he's got a very Toy Story themed lanyard. He got this Duffy popcorn bucket. He comes in a little sack and then you open a sack of popcorn kernels. You open the boat. How does it work? Here. White chocolate popcorn and then it, it was kind of it, it was pretty good. I loved it. Moving on to the last thing we got in Tokyo. All the Star Wars nerds from here are going to be so jealous. It is an R2D2 bucket. They had these. I had room for four in my clothes in my suitcase and so I was like I'm buying four. So this is the last one I purchased. Because there was, this was the other best one. There's still little pieces of popcorn in there. Ooh, caramel. Next up is kind of like a conjoined thing between the both of us, but he keeps it in his room. It's this annual pass holder popcorn bucket. They had this for a while where you could get dollar refills with your popcorn bucket, which was like amazing and they don't do it anymore, but it's still a really It was cute only for like a few bucket. months. Um, I have this that I bought during Christmas. It is such a good team. I didn't get the Halloween one, which is kind of sad. It was a vampire. Yeah. But we went on the last day of Halloween, so. Mm -hmm. But I got, I got him, which is he's Santa, and this is like a different material. It's very nice feeling. Ooh. Ooh. And he also is carrying a stack of toys, goodies. It looks like a cape, but it's not. It's it's like, this is what last year's design was for uh -huh. Christmas. It is a, also a Mickey elf. And oh. this is Mickey Santa. This is a Mickey elf. Notice that we're being gypped. Um, it got smaller. Gypped. Hashtag gift. I think we have two more things from Tokyo, so Grandma's gonna show you this. I'm gonna show you this. So this is um, this is an under alien, and it was we went during Halloween time, so he has a pumpkin on his skewer, and um, this held the alien mochi, which we tried in our first trying di Tokyo Disneyland food vlog, which I'll put up on the screen. And the last thing, I forced my mom to buy this, but like I told her, I'm like, Mom, you need this, and then she bought it, but I use it all the time, and it's this genie cup from Tokyo. Um, the problem with all the Tokyo mugs and water bottles is that they were freaking tiny and so this was like the biggest one they had and it was the genie and I was like, mom, you need it and I drink soda out of this all the time. So it's on Solo Frozen, I think the word is carbonite. And then I got this right when um, The Force Awakens came out and I was obsessed with it. It's a BB-8. It's a sipper. I actually bought one of these on the night that I met Patrick for the first time. Second time. And it's a thigh fighter and it held popcorn. Uh huh. But I didn't. I had the popcorn in a separate bucket and they put it inside the. Like they had the bucket. They had, I had the popcorn, like cardboard thingy inside. Um. So I collect these cups from Disneyland. Actually, I kind of. St I have 
three of them i stopped collecting them because they had a jungle book one that i was just like i don't want to spend like 10 bucks on this i'd rather spend 10 bucks on something else so i have this avengers one though and it has this was when civil war came out but it's not specifically civil war there's iron man and captain america so this is zero lights up Ooh, you can see it yay next up i have this little red car trolley this came with ice cream. I got this a while back. Wall camera is still going. I have a few things left, so I'm gonna show you some of them. It said that I had more of like the Avengers type cups. The first one I bought is was for Inside Out when that was first released. It looks like this, and it has all the characters on it, and it's kind of see-through if you can tell. Like, doo -doo 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 -doo. then I got the same one, but for Zootopia. I wish that this one had characters on it. Unfortunately, it just has the city background, which is still really cool, but I wish there was like a bunch of characters on it, like the inside out one. Uh, so I bought this and I'm intending on buying the other two and making like a pyramid, it's gonna be really cool. But for now, I have this one. It's the Dynaco Sipper from Cars. Uh-huh. It looks like an oil can and it's super cute. Then I have this really insanely crazy cup that I love to use because literally you could look at this cup all day and find new different characters hidden throughout it. It is such a cool cup. I don't know if they still sell this anymore, but this is like at the World of Disney. They can get this pretty much anywhere, and I am obsessed with it. I love, like, I used to take this to class in the morning. I would be bored in chemistry, and I would just drink out of it and just stare at it because there were so many cool characters on it. So, yeah. You never told me that. Super cute. I thought that this would be cool. So, when we went to Disneyland and trick or treated, I don't like most of the stuff that they give out. So we specifically asked for Sour Patch Kids. Mm -hmm. I used to have three of these full. Now we're down to this one, but I, it's the Halloween one from a, a year or two ago. And it's got skeletons, spooky, scary skeletons. The chasing down your spine. So this one's a holiday themed one. And it was around Christmas time. It's like kind of vintage looking. This is and it's like a, it's a it's a cart from Big Thunder Mountain. It's an old cart. It's, full of it's the wildest ride in the wilderness. And well, this last thing is kind of boring, but it's really cute. It's this water bottle that I bought during the 60th anniversary. I bought so much freaking stuff for the 60th anniversary. It's kind of embarrassing. Okay, that's what it looks like. This is like the standard 60th design. It is so cute. That's it for this video. I really hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Who does that? Somebody I know goes big thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe. This is just a little part of my story, and I hope you stick around for the next chapters. Well, bye! Bye! I wish to stay.